Hello everyone, today I'll be doing a tutorial on how I get my beachy waves. Now, right now you cannot see the waves because it rained today and my hair got really flat and humid as you can tell. So I already did this step, but I like brushing my hair so I'll do it again. Start off by sectioning your hair in two pieces and brushing from the bottom with a paddle brush or a wig brush. You're going to brush it till it's nice and smooth. And get your leave out as well. And starting from the bottom. Brushing, brushing. Now, I already did this step as well. Um, I use Moroccan Argan Oil Renewing Penetrating Oil. And I put about a nickel size in my hand. And I basically focus on the back because that's where it tends to tangly. Well, not this hair. This hair is perfect. Honestly, I don't get any shedding. Well, I do get shedding. I get about six strands a day if I don't brush it. And I just start at the back. And I just go down. Really focus on the ends. And then just, you know, rub it down. Now, you also need bobby pins. I have a little tiny ones, but you can use any size. So after I moisturized my hair and sectioned it, you're going to want to section it again into two pieces. Now, the more twists that you do, the more waves that you'll get. So today I'm going to do six. Actually, I'm going to do eight. Yeah. So I section one piece into two pieces and then I'm going to section another piece, the smaller piece, into two sections. Okay? So I'm going to come closer so you guys can see how I twist the hair. So I'm making sure my edges are down and I'm just twisting really, really tight. Like one big wad. Twisting really tight twist it into a little bun as you can see make sure you don't get any of the hair from your other twisty into it Now, once you get your little ball like this, you're going to take your bobby pin and pin it down. You just want to make sure it stays. So you have a little twisty like that. Now you're going to continue with the other piece. I'm going to brush this again. Because, you know, you know, who likes tangled hair? So again, we twist, twist, twist. Twisty twist, twist. Once you get about halfway, you can start to put it into your little bun bun. See, I'm like twisting it right here in the back. And kind of bringing it around. This takes practice, so do not get discouraged or frustrated because it is all worth it. And you're not putting heat to your hair. 
which is a plus. Again, we are going to pin it down. Section her off. Just, You're going to want to try to pin it down as flat as you can because it is kind of uncomfortable sleeping in. I want her pinned down. Last piece on this side, getting it down to the middle. And I guarantee these are going to be so cute when you wake up. I'm telling you. See, so one side is done. It's pretty flat, so it won't be uncomfortable for me to sleep in. If you guys can see that, I hope you can. So now I'm going to get started on the next side.
Okay, so the finished product on both sides. Let's see. So in the morning, I will undo my twisties and show you guys the finished product. So, okay, so it's the next day. Just woke up, got dressed, took a shower, ready for school. Now I'm gonna take out. Turn your fingers through it, make sure you got all the pins out. And basically, I'm just going to finger comb your hair. You can see. It's like wavy, curly, cuteness with no heat. Finger comb. volumize my hair. Curly, messy waves. I finished with no heat, just a little twisties or bantu knots, whatever you want to call them. And these will last you all day. Just keep you know, keep playing with it if you want. But, that is it.